Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I love you. Happy Monday morning. So, this will be for the next two weeks, November 2019. We are going to do Libra. My librarians, let's see what you's up to. Let's see what you're up to. Two at a time. Got the four of wands, nine of cups. Absolutely beautiful. There's some type of celebration, some type of foundation being built. You're happy, you're content. There's definitely something mid-month going down. I can feel it. It's going down. But, I mean, you're just, you're happy. You're like a, a, a pig in shit. Okay, that's, that's quite the term they just had me use with you. <clears throat> wow, this didn't want to stay in my hands. <laughs> eight of Wands, like that journey can't come quick enough. I mean, this Eight of Wands, it, it's just coming out in a lot of these reads. It's, it's a message. It's... To me, it's a very spiritual card. Um, but this is an actual message coming towards you or going out. It looks very positive. It's regarding a journey, a new start to a coin. So stay balanced because you're just getting yourself out of something. It does that saying, two coins to every side, two sides to every coin. <laughs> you got to love me. Um, so it's like the message you're going to get, it, it's like, there's always two stories, right? So it's whatever this message is regarding, it's, it's balance, it's moving forward. Tell me about the four of wands, please. It's, it's happy, it's positive, energy's flowing, could be moving locations, you could be moving into a place, looking at places, talking about it, because I did see the chariot, that looks like a physical, a physical move, three card just came out ace of swords ace of cups and the ten of coin this is definitely communication speaking from the heart being honest there's something so pure here it's it's beautiful it's what a foundation you are going to have it is going to feel extremely solid there is no question on how this is going to be presented or come off, or this is this the energy now? You just you feel good within the household. You're happy. Tell me about the nine of cups. Got the queen of swords. I don't know how you're gonna feel about this message. <laughs> oh my goodness, this reminds me of um, I think it's Taurus and Pisces, um, <clears throat> but. It's, that's you guys straight to the point like cutting no bullshit direct so you might deliver it or you're getting it tell me about the eight of wands you could be getting a message from an air sign fire sign can't help somebody is in love um, I don't know if you're talking to him right now or not. I think you know who this is. But they certainly want to ground something. Tell me about the two of coin. That didn't completely flip, but it wanted to. Thank you. Two of coin, two of coin. 
they could be juggling their thoughts or you're, gonna, you're about to juggle your thoughts when it comes to them. My Aries had the King of Coin. That's too many. Two of Coin, two of Coin. Ace of Wands. So someone's feeling awfully inspired. There's definitely a transformation going on somewhere. Got the High Priestess at the bottom of the deck and then it follows the Death card. Something is about to be transformed. Some type of foundation. I mean, it's just, it's so positive. Yeah. Not quite the foundation. I mean, there's just, there's nothing but positivity here. I don't know if you see it coming though, because I'm kind of like, huh? Where is it? So I don't know if that's what you're feeling. Tell me about this Queen of Swords. Right in your energy though, like right, right in your element. Judgment in the Page of Wands. So this talks about a new start, second chances. Um, I believe it was Cancer that had these cards. Had judgment. And that's a spiritual journey. Again, it's like spiritual judgment. Will you give someone a second chance? Tell me about the four of wands. You had the six of swords under the deck and Cancer had the same thing. You might want to watch Cancer. But this was spiritual judgment going in, in their favor. Yeah, four of wands, ten of cups, queen of coins. You're going to be extremely happy. Well, you are extremely happy. But to me, this is... I mean, you get the nine of cups and the, the ten of cups. It's like a, a dream coming true. Like... You're going to be living in it. You're going to be feeling it. <clears throat> um, there's no question. Could be dealing with Taurus, too. Because that's a Taurus energy. If Taurus makes you happy, you uh, vice versa. Got Taurus, Pisces, Libra. Got all sorts, but... This talks about a new new fresh start and enlightenment. Just this is so positive, but I feel I don't know how to explain it. So I don't think you feel this yet. If that makes sense. Like your foundation your foundation, your your home life, your work life, your love life. Is about to drastically shift. It's up to you. It, it's there's going to be something that comes in where you're going to have to make a judgment call. This will be presented to you. This is not something where it's like you have to figure out how to get to. You know what I mean? It's it's not like that. This will be something that is presented to you to make a judgment call. I hope that helps and makes you feel better because that's always better than, oh, you know, I, I don't know, I don't know. You know, so this is going to be blatantly obvious. Okay, hope that helps. It looks fantastic. I love you guys. Uh, if you want further insight on, on what's kind of really going down, you know, there's links below for a personal reading. All right. I love you guys. Bye.